It's Friday, October 10th, 2014. Hello, I'm Veronique Masterson. Here's what you need to know about what's happening at the University of Texas at El Paso. Minor pride and tons of orange and blue are all over campus as Centennial Homecoming festivities ramp up. Tonight, past distinguished alumni and Gold Nugget Award recipients will come together for a reunion gala at the Don Haskins Center. The event is an opportunity for people to interact with an inspiring group of UTEP graduates who've made a significant impact on the the world through their careers. Tomorrow, Saturday, October 11th, will be packed with more UTEP spirit beginning at 1 p.m. with the homecoming parade. The parade will start on Oregon Street and end on Glory Road. The parade will feature UTEP's marching band, cheerleaders, athletes, and creative floats. The end of the parade will mark the beginning of the homecoming pep rally at 2 p.m. at Glory Field. Of course, don't miss was arguably the biggest draw for homecoming this year's football game against Old Dominion. Kickoff is at 6 p.m. at Sun Bowl Stadium. Starting at 5 a.m. Sunday, October 12th, I-10 near UTEP will be entirely closed. The closure will continue until 5 a.m. Monday, October 13th. During that time, construction crews will remove the Andel Bridge and a permanent concrete barrier will be placed on the new Spur 1966 bridge. Westbound traffic will be directed to exit at Porfirio Diaz Street and re-enter I-10 at the Schuster entrance ramp. Eastbound motorists will exit at Sullivan Park Drive, detour through Paisano, and re-enter the interstate through the US-54 ramp. UTEP seniors, make sure to stop by the Peter and Margaret DeWetter Center for the UTEP Fall 2014 Grad Fair next week. From 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. Tuesday, October 14th through Thursday, October 16th, you can get your cap, gown, and tassel for winter commencement. Also take a minute to make your mark on UTEP Centennial Celebration with a video recording that will be shared with thousands of fellow minors. All students are invited to share their minor pride at the UTEP Grad Fair's Centennial Photo and Video Booth. The booth will be available from 9 a.m. to noon on Tuesday and Wednesday. From soon-to-be UTEP graduates to future minors, we take a look back at our more than 5,000 square mile 12 school district centennial celebration that took place last Friday. The excitement could be heard and seen as more than 183,760 students at more than 250 schools in the region were told to dream big and continue their education. For more information about these and other stories, check out utepnews.com. I'm Veronique Masterson. We'll see you next Friday. Go Miners! Pursue their biggest dream.